Hello, in this video, we will introduce conversion between strings and arrays. Now, let's look at this method, to shell array. So this is the string invoking this method. You're gonna obtain an array of characters from this string. And this is the method get shells. So you have this is the uh, string invoking get shells two, six, and this is the destination here four. So what is this? Is this is the uh, in this in this source here, this this is two, and the ends with this before six ends with actually five. So this is three seven two zero, and you're gonna put this into this destination. Destination is right here into this location at the index four zero one two three four. It's right here. So it replaces this four characters using this four characters, three, seven, two, zero. So that is get shells. You can, we already know that you can create a string from an array of characters. So this is the example, and this is anonymous array. <clears throat> and you can use value of and to create a string and from this array of characters too. So this is string dot value of. Now let's jump to the next section here is looking at the uh, converting characters and the numerical values to string using all this value of static methods in the string class to convert a character to string converting an array of character to string, converting a double, float, int, long, boolean to string using the string of methods. Formatting strings. We already know how to format an output. And you're going to use the same syntax here for the uh, specifying the uh, format using the format specifier. So using this string dot format, you specify the format specifier. So one, two, three. So there's three. So the format specifier begins with this percentage size. And this is the uh, uh, float. And this is the precision is two. And this is the width is seven. So that is for the item and three items here. And the result is a string. So the format string. That is all for this video. See you on the next video.